Testing? Testing? Okay, welcome to the video. Um, here we're looking at a comparative box plot showing the distribution of salaries for construction workers and teachers, and we're asked to um, use some information given in statistical language to evaluate who's making more money according to these two distributions. So first of all, let's look at the first piece of information given here. It says Jenny makes the minimum salary for a construction worker. So we're going to go look at the get the pen to work. We're going to go look at the construction worker salary distribution, this first one. And as we look at that box plot, notice the minimum can be found using the first bar on the box, right? That's the minimum. As we work across, we've got min, Q1, median, Q3, and max. So the min is right here. If we look down to the horizontal axis, that's $30,000. So it's telling me Jenny, right, the units there are 1,000, so 30,000. So it tells me Jenny makes 30,000. I'll just write that there so I can look back at it. Now let's move on to Marcos. It says Marcos makes the median salary for a teacher. So if we go to our teacher plot here and we count up, here's my min, here's Q1, my median is the middle bar in that box. So there's my median. So we see the median salary for a teacher is $40,000. So that's what Marcos is making. So the question asks, who makes more money? Well, we can see 40000 versus 30000 Marcos is making more money. How much more? Well, we can subtract there. 40000 minus 30000 gives me 10000 When we enter it, I think it's, you want to avoid putting parentheses in, so we just enter it as 10000. Zero, 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 zero. Marcos is making 10000 more than Jenny.